message has been retweeted almost 18,000 times and liked more than 34,000 times at the time of writing. It claims motorcycle boss Matthew S. Lovitich had said, Our decision to move some of our operations is 100% based on President Trump's sick tariffs. Mr. Trump knows nothing about economics and even less about trade. The man is a moron. And it has been picked up by a string of celebrities and anti-Trump groups who spread it to hundreds of thousands of Twitter followers. Among the well-known people to have repeated the quote are author Stephen King, for 8 million followers, actor Ron Perlman, 700,000 followers, and Amy Holden Jones, screenwriter of Beethoven and Indecent Proposal, 16,000 followers. The quote is entirely fake on Tuesday's threatened Harley Davidson Incorporated with unspecified higher taxes over the motorcycle maker's decision to move some production out of the United States to its international facilities in response to EU motorcycle tariffs. Since then, Mr. Lovitich has become a target for Donald Trump's fans online A fake quote appears to have originated by a Twitter account under the name of Judy Tinselman, who claims to be a political analyst working in Washington, D.C. But prior to tweeting the inflammatory quote, the account had just one follower It now has almost 500 a spokesman for Harley Davidson told The Mirror, the tweet is completely vague. Mr. Lovitich has not spoken publicly about the move, nor commented on the president's tweets the account went on to post a quote it claims was from President Trump and reported by Politico, if Harley Davidson moves part of their production from Kansas City to Thailand, I will tax them into bankruptcy big time. While President Trump has used his Twitter account to threaten the motorcycle manufacturer with heavy taxes, the above quote is fake.